So a lot of people ask, why the heck bow ties? And I think that's a great question, and it's more important to focus on the purpose behind it rather than the bow ties themselves. So if we go back to April of 2017, I was informed that the second poorest people group in the Western Hemisphere, they fall right behind Haiti, doesn't live abroad. They're actually right within the United States. The Pine Ridge Indian Reservation in South Dakota is home to roughly a few thousand people, but has an 80% unemployment rate with youth suicides being around 20 with over 200 attempts in last year alone. But rather than focus on the statistics behind it, it's more important to focus on their people. They have purpose and they have value. So fast forward a little bit to April and I paid them a visit. And when you go on the reservation, you do see rundown homes. You see people coming out of places where you thought that they were abandoned. But you also learn about the skill sets that are vibrant in their culture. Sewing, leather craft, beadwork, they're still very alive. And as they say, they run in their blood. I specifically remember meeting Wilma. She's about in her 70s, but she has a lot of character and a lot of sass. She would tell me about the quilts she would make and also the beadwork she would do. This is an abalone, it's called abalone shout. And these are bones. Sometimes she'd be so focused in her work that she would begin to, or she'd actually forget to eat lunch. And I can relate to that, being a seamstress myself. And I began to think, okay, how can we step alongside these skill sets and take their story beyond their reservation? And that's where the bow ties come into play. So while yes, this bow tie is a statement piece, it's also a piece that can have a story to it. It's one that breaks the ice and starts conversations. So our goal at Elroy and Men is to step alongside the artisans on the Pine Ridge Reservation to help bring economic development to their community. So with that unemployment rate being so high, we don't wanna just provide them a job, we wanna provide them an environment that emphasizes their purpose and value something that's so different from the hopelessness that they feel in the reservation. So when you purchase a bow tie, you're helping us create an avenue towards that economic development. You're saying, we see your pain, but we also see your value. And I'm gonna showcase it when I wear it. So I think it's about time that we give style a higher purpose, that we stop depending on the government to give more assistance, that we stop saying writing checks is gonna make a difference because transformation comes through long-term partnerships and long-term relationships. So what do you say? Are you ready to make a purchase?